white. After you have the color picked out, let's choose the sizes that we want. And once that looks good, let's go and decorate. So we can add a design, you can add text, add a team name. Let's add a design. Uh, with the light dry fit shirts, dye sublimation works real well. If you want to know the difference between dye sublimation and screen printing, you can find it on our website or you can email us or give us a call and we'll be happy to answer any questions you might have. So we are going to sublimate that. Uh, we do have a, a, a good amount of stock art for you to choose from. You can either scroll through here and find something you like, or we do have it broken down in different categories here. Uh, but we are going to upload from our computer. So we click the Browse button. This is going to open up your documents in your computer. And here we are. Let's go with Marlin Big Game. And it's going to take a little bit to upload. Uh, larger files do work best, or any vector art uh, that was created in Illustrator, Corel Draw, or as an EPS file, whatever it might be. If you do, if you have any questions about the artwork, email us or give us a call. We'll be happy to answer any questions. Uh, this is, uh, if you do upload your artwork, you do have to have permission to use it. It can't be trademarked, so let's click that. Click OK. Once this is uploaded, you can move it. You can move the artwork up and down, side to side. You can uh, grab this and make it larger. When you do upload a JPEG, you're going to get a white area. Usually it's a white area. So let's get rid of that and we'll get a better idea of how this is going to look. So we click on the select transparent button over here and like I said usually the back image is going to be white so let's go under named colors. White is going to be on the right all the way down so let's click that now we've gotten rid of that. So let's enlarge that. We like the placement, we like the size of that. Uh, if you do see this, that this is either telling you that your image is out of the the allotted print zone or that the image might not be in the correct format or might uh, you might have some problems with your artwork. If you do see this, email us the artwork and we'll let you know if you're going to have any problems with it or if it needs tweaking. But uh, we like this. this is, we're out of the print area so that's what it's letting us know. Let's, uh, let's go to the back and let's add text on the back. Again, dye sublimation. Our name is going to be Big Game. Add text. Okay, again, with the same with the front artwork, we can move it up and down, side to side. We can grab this, make it bigger, smaller. Let's uh, let's change the font on this. We have a good selection of different fonts for you to choose from. Uh, let's try Tobago Poster. And this is going to give us a preview of what this looks like. Uh, you'll notice that that got a little bit bigger. Some of the fonts are going to be different sizes. So if you need to change the, uh, the size of that, you can grab this, make it smaller, make it bigger, whatever you need to do. So uh, this looks good. Let's change uh, the color. If you're familiar with RGB colors, you can set your colors here or if you want to just grab a standard name color, let's try royal blue. That's going to give us an idea of what that looks like. Okay, so we like the way that looks. Uh, let's double check the front. We like the placement. We like the size. Big game. Everything's spelled right. Uh, you can, ch if you want to see what the diff what it would look like on a different color shirt, you can edit the color over here. Uh, if you notice that you made a mistake on the sizes, you can edit the sizes. You can save a layout if you're not done working on this. Um, and next time you come back and sign in, this is going to be waiting for you to finish it up. You can also share your designs with friends or family uh, and get their opinion on it. You just put their email address, your name, your email, or you could share it on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest. And 
if everything is ready to go you like what you see you can add it to your cart and go through the simple checkout process and if you have any again if you have any questions let us know uh, I know I went through this pretty quick so I might have missed some things so just email us with any artwork or any artwork questions any kind of questions you might have and we'll be happy to answer anything all right well thanks for watching the video and we hope to talk to you soon